good morning i literally just woke up right now and this is the hair from yesterday yeah welcome back it's been a while i know let's just say i have a lot to update you on uh, but we'll get to that later on once i get fully awake so right now it is 7 16 i'm gonna shower and brush my teeth because i literally just woke up my face is moisturized teeth are brushed i just washed my body i feel like doing my hair because it's cold outside i'm filling my water bottle because i like to drink like about two of these at least so i'm just gonna fill it up real quick and then i'm gonna go to my room and go ahead and get ready all right you guys so this is my room slash guest room this is where i get ready my scalp is getting a little itchy because i have a really dry scalp especially during this time it gets worse You'll see a little dandruff, just ignore it. So the gel I'm using is the Hair Heritage. This one. I like using it for my braids. I just put it on the top, like right here. How did y'all's New Year's Christmas go? Christmas Eve. I had to work and it was really busy. That same day on Christmas Eve, I went to my parents' house. Because we were going to pray to baby Jesus. And then Christmas Day in the morning, my mom made some tacos de lengua. That was good. In the evening, so I had to make some. So I was going to make tostadas. Like one of them the tinga, the other one the carne molida. And I was going to make rice and salsa. The only thing that sucked is that I only have one big pan or skillet. Does that make sense? I had to make everything on there. Thankfully, my mother-in-law gave me two new skillets. So that definitely comes in handy. So Christmas Day, I spent it with um, Damon's family. It was pretty fun. I feel like the day went by really fast because like we're busy doing games. I usually spend Christmas in Mexico. It's like always a tradition. Last year we didn't go because all the stuff that's going around. This year I didn't go because I'm going in February. I'm going February with Damien. We're doing the peregrinación. I think we're walking for three or four days from our town to Plateros. I'm excited actually. It's been a while since I've done it. I did it with my dad a while back. I think it was like six years ago, maybe. Something like that. So, I'm just going to pause here. And because my um, camera's about to die. So, I'm just going to finish up doing my hair. And then I'll be back. I'm going to go ahead and make my coffee. I put one stevia. I use this coffee it's a colombian coffee and just one spoon i put some caramel this thing was dripping caramel this one that's why i have the paper towel put a little bit i put some of this stuff it's a sugar-free syrup this one's a vanilla that much i honestly don't even know if it's like add flavor or not it just makes me feel like i'm getting a coffee at starbucks it's just an illusion literally and i put some of the caramel this one's also the sugar free. I go ahead and pour the water. This is the mug my cousin gave to me. Super cute. I fill it up like three fourths. Half of my hair is done. I only did a half braid because when I got done recording, I forgot if I was braiding under or over. So I kind of messed up. And then I'm using some creamer. I use the Starbucks my chocolate mocha. That much. And then I put the cinnamon doce. Doce? Sure. This one's my fave. I know it'd be looking a little crusty, but don't worry. I put just a tiny bit of that. More of this, less of the cinnamon because it's really potent. So then you mix it. My morning voice has, still hasn't been, you know, out of my system. I add some marshmallows, the mini ones, and I put like, this much to where it covers the whole um, top. And then after that, I top it off with some cinnamon. Just a tiny bit, but go easy. It's just garnish, literally. Here is my coffee. Super delish. Y'all need to try it. Oh, look how look crusty. Ooh, that is so good. I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my braid, and yeah. 
Okay, guys. Good morning. I totally um, left y'all hanging the other day. I was supposed to show you what I did that day. I was supposed to clean. I was going to show everything. Well, that's what happens. When you try to plan the day, it doesn't really go the way you want sometimes. And today is... What is today? Today is Thursday, January 6th. For some reason, I've been waking up at like 5.20. And it's just like so early. Like, what the heck? So I've been up since 5.20. It's 7 o'clock right now. I was watching my own YouTube videos, my old videos. And I was just like looking back. It's just so crazy. Like, how different things are now. I was like, damn, like I miss my room. My old room. But you know, things change. I'm using this LA Girl Pro Conceal. This is in the shade Toffee. I use this as a contour. And I was also noticing like on my old videos, like how I was so into like makeup. And I really was, honestly. I'm hoping it's the same shade. I'm gonna be pissed if it's not, cause I ran out of this one. It has good coverage and it's very lightweight under my eyes. I notice I crease a lot because I bought this. I'm like, oh, let me just try something new. So I bought this L'Oreal infallible full wear and it's too thick for my under eyes. I like it because it's brightening and for sure brightens up my under eye area, but it's a little um, too bright and too thick for my liking. And that is a reason why I don't buy new concealers because like now i'm gonna have to use it all because i bought it you know i feel bad throwing it away we'll see how the day goes what i just started making a habit is getting ready every morning even if it's just like minimal makeup just so i can like feel good about myself let me show you the products i use that way i don't have to like talk through the video that way it's not that long so i use that bronzer i mean that contour and then i use this sweet cheeks the shade i don't know what shade this is but i use it for my cheeks then i use this for my concealer the wet and wild photo focus translucent for to set my under eyes and then this elf bronzer then this one for my blush it's the shade mellow wine and then for highlight i use this one that's pretty much it and mascara i use the l'oreal telescopic so I just got done getting ready. This is how my makeup looks. Just simple. I'm about to make some breakfast. I think I'm just gonna eat leftovers. So I do have some leftover pancakes. I don't know who bit this. Um, just gonna throw this one away. I'm just gonna assume these are still good. They were made on Sunday. Today's Thursday. I mean, they smell fine. And I'm about to fill up this with water. Oh, and also too, it's really good to put your fruit in like mason jars. Your fruit lasts a lot longer like that. So I'm just going to pour it in here and then put some syrup I'm using this one. I'm just going to sit back and relax. Watch some videos on YouTube. I'll see y'all after I eat. Okay, so I was cold and I put on my blanket hoodie on. I got this for Christmas from my suegra. I washed some dishes this morning. So I just moved everything to the other side of the sink. And they dry pretty quickly. I'm going to go ahead and put up some of the dishes. And then start washing these other dishes I have in the sink. So yeah, that's the system I got going on. I get a lot of natural lighting in here oh let me show you how the house looks dirty af i got shit everywhere stuff on the ground i need to clean my room everything's unorganized and i'll show you our room our room is a mess as well yep that's pretty much it and then the restroom just dirty on the okay i know i need to clean the restroom as well so i'll be working on that today cleaning uh, i might wash today i think it's too cold to wash today i don't know we'll see